Hi students, welcome to week 11. This is my final check-in with you, so I'm hoping that you are feeling good and ready for finals. Um, I did want to say one thing before we run through the assignments. I am right in the middle of grading your case studies from week 10, and I just wanted to say that I'm very impressed with the work so far, uh, especially with the recent events in our um, in our country, especially in Orlando. It's It's tough to sit through newscast after newscast um, dealing with these scenarios. But when I read your work and I am reading through and seeing acceptance and tolerance of all different types of people, I think that that is just a little uplifting. So thank you for that. And keep in mind, whenever you're in healthcare, you don't have to agree with your neighbor, you don't have to agree with your patients, but you do need to treat them with the utmost respect. And that's what I've seen so far in your work. So thank you for being a bright spot in my day. All right, under the Lessons tab, if we go to week 11, you'll notice that a little bit shorter than usual, we have a um, discussion, that self-reflection, and then also the final exam. Both of those need to be completed by Friday. So that means that your due date for the, um, the discussion has been moved up one day. I'll take a look at the calendar with you just so we reiterate that. The end of the course here is on week is on the 17th, Friday. So the work that's due is your discussion and your final exam. Um, and this goes for your lab exam too, which I know is separate from this course, but um, everything has to be in by 11.59 p.m. that night. No exceptions. Absolutely no extensions. So please work ahead. Make sure you're planning ahead. That you get everything done on time. If you have any questions about anything in the next few days, please let me know. I'm here to help, and I hope that you all have a nice finals week and that you're excited for your break. All right. Have a good one, guys.